Hope you and your family are having a wonderful Christmas Eve, and I hope you guys are staying warm as that feels like temperature is going to drop well below zero yet again. Here's some stats for Christmas Day in La Crosse. The warmest was 1982, where we had a temperature of 46 degrees. The coldest was one year later, where we went down to four degrees below zero. The snowiest was 1950, where we had 5.3 inches of snow, and the wettest was a little more recent, 2009. We had 64 hundredths of an inch of rain. Now, welcome to hour number 217 of the deep freeze. The last time we were above freezing was December 15th at 540 p.m. And we do have a windchill advisory in effect for everybody in the News 8 Now viewing area. This expires at 10 o'clock tomorrow morning. As we help you plan your Saturday night going into Sunday, we'll see that feels like temperature between 15 to 25 degrees below zero. That trend will continue for your Sunday morning. And then we kind of get above zero as we go to the afternoon, early evening hours. Some places will stay well below zero going into your Monday morning. But the good news, if you're tired of this cold weather, the Climate Prediction Center has temperatures going above normal as we go into the second half of next week. So here's a look at your forecast for tonight. Single digits across the board, clear skies, crazy cold. That wind chill, like I said, between 15 to 25 degrees below zero. Winds are going to stay out of the west northwest between 15 to 20 miles per hour. Some places seeing gusts as high as 30 miles per hour. Hey, I'm keeping an eye on Santa. Let's see where he's located right now. He is 3,390 miles away. He is in London, England. You can see as we zoom in to England, you can see, let's see if we see him. See, there's the big bend. And let's see if we can find Santa. Oh, oh there he is right there. So, yes, he is in London, England at this time, so he's inching his way closer to the United States. So when you wake up in the morning, temperatures below zero will greet you. One below in Sparta, five below in La Crosse, two below in Winona, three below in Eau Claire, one below in Ladysmith. And you can see the clouds dissipate as we go into your evening and overnight hours. We'll be left with clear skies. The clouds will pick up again for Sunday afternoon into the evening hours. Highs on Sunday. There you go. We'll see temperatures in the single digits, low teens towards Prairie de Chine as well as Boscobel. So here's how we get there in terms of the feels like temperature. There you go. 21 degrees by the 8 o'clock hour, 6 below by the 2 o'clock hour, and then zero between 6 and 8 o'clock. So definitely bundle up tomorrow. So we're going to go down to 4 degrees below zero for tonight with clear skies. Just a downright chilly evening. Winds will be out of the northwest at 10 to 15 miles per hour the next eight days. We go to 14 on Monday, 23 on Tuesday, back into the mid 30s for Wednesday, 40s for Thursday and Friday, Saturday to finish out 2022. We go to 40 degrees and then when we ring in the new year, look at that Sunday, first day of 2023, we go to 44 degrees with a 20% chance of rain. The bottom line, there is light at the end of the tunnel, and I don't know about you, but I think these next days right here, I'm going to be washing my car. Dua, what do you think? My car needs such a bad car wash. It is gross out there, man.